Welcome back, YouTube. It's in the kitchen with Brother Zach. Today I'm going to show you guys how to make that strawberry crunch cake, the uh, outer crunch for the crunch cake. And all you need is very simple. It's not going to be a long video. All you need is some vanilla uh, pudding mix, instant, and you need some Jello pudding strawberry mix. You're going to need a whole stick of butter. I went on ahead and already cut it in half. You're going to need two bowls. This is really, really simple. You need to pour a cup of flour. Pour a cup of flour. And bring the camera down so y'all can see. Yes, you will fall. Yes, you'll mess up, but you'll get back up. Cause mercy is enough. It endures forever. It won't stop. But after you repent, don't pick it back up. Let it drop. Up higher. All praise to the Father. All praise to the Son. We've been through the fire. We've been through the storm. And all praise to a higher. And all praise to a Son. We've been through the rain. We've been through the storm. And all praise to a higher. So we're looking for a, a crumbly consistency. You're gonna take the back of the fork and you're just gonna mash it in like that till you get the consistency you're looking for. I'm gonna show you the consistency that you're looking for. Why more is he who we like me? My lamp is dim, now it's brightening. It glow the fist on him vice. So I'm gonna pause the video and I'll be back. Alright, we back. This is what it looks like. You got this grainy looking texture. Now with the jello, the strawberry jello, it's gonna be a little, it's not gonna be like the pudding, uh, like the pudding, the vanilla pudding one. So it's gonna be a little more pastier looking. Let me see how I look a little bit more pastier, but it's okay. Then it with a vanilla pudding one. It's a little bit more grainy. This is the texture we're looking for. So now we're gonna get ready to put it on our uh, cookie sheet on some parchment paper. You can use parchment paper or wax paper. Parchment paper or wax paper only. matter if you mix them together or not. It's up to you. You're still gonna mix and blend together in the blender when you're pouring your food processor. Kind of blending it together. Mixing the vanilla in with the strawberries. Mash it down on the parchment paper like so. Spread it out a little bit. It ain't gotta be perfect. Kind of spread it out like dough, like cookie dough. 
But again, it don't have to be perfect, of course. Remember, in culinary arts, you are in control. Always say that. You are in control. You can't go no wrong in your kitchen. It's in the pain, the main pain. is in order. This life is going to get harder. Just come back to the Father. And your love steps will be ordered. Now what we're going to do is put this in the oven, 350 degrees, for six minutes. Six minutes, Dougie Fresh on your own. Six minutes only. This is how it looks, flatten out. You're going to put it in the oven for seven minutes, I'm sorry, seven minutes. Any any longer than seven minutes, I promise you, you will burn it, burn it and scorch it. You don't want to do that. Great. I thought I had my oven ready. Wow. So I'm going to pause the video. All right, here it goes. It came out the freezer. I put it in the freezer for about a half hour to 45 minutes. So what it do is going to have this little crusty, you want a crusty um, type texture. So we're just going to break it up. Put it into our uh, my blender. You got a food processor, that'll be fine. My food pro I have a food processor, but I processor, but I have a small one. It's one of these small ones here. See, it's too small and it takes longer. You can only put small pieces of uh of the uh the mix in there at one time because it'll keep clogging up. You have to keep clearing it out. So what I found best is I can put more of the mixture into my uh, blender. Mm -hmm. you know, just pause, just pause. Just hitting the pause. Don't you, know me, don't you see I'm recording you just barking? Of course, you don't have big pieces in there. You want to just remove them or break them up if they are. I got a Ziploc bag and I just pour them in here. Some aluminum foil just to catch the uh, the excess uh, crumbs that drop. Kobe, what did Kobe? What did I say? You still barking? Oh, um, I guess it don't matter. You are gonna keep barking regardless of what I say. You're just a doggy. I'm gonna pause the video and I'll be right back. All right, here we go. I got it bagged up. It's already crumbled up. 
So what I'm doing now is filling an order for a cake. So I'm, I've already done this video for you guys. So for those that haven't seen it, you're welcome to go back in my playlist and look for that strawberry crunch cake cheesecake. All right, I'm about to stop the video. I hope you guys had a blessed day, a blessed evening. Uh, like always, hey, Kobe in the background. For some reason, Kobe want to uh, say hi to y'all, but he's, he's speaking to y'all though. But until next time, be a blessing to someone, love on somebody. Shalom, peace, and shalom.